What are the best baseball movies of all time? Number 20, Hardball. A nameless young man agrees to coach a Little League baseball team as a condition of getting a loan from a friend. Starring Keanu Reeves and Diane Lane. This was also the feature film debut of Michael B. Jordan. Hardball and The Glass House were both released on 9-14-2001. The first two major motion pictures are released after the terrorist attacks on 9-11. Both films co-starred Diane Lane. Number 19. For Love of the Game. A baseball legend has one last chance to prove who he is, what he's capable of, and decide if he will prioritize his career or risk everything to win the heart of a woman. Starring Kevin Costner, Kelly Preston, and John C. Riley. Kevin Costner has appeared in four baseball-themed movies. Bull Durham, Field of Dreams, For the Love of the Game, and The Upside of Anger. Number 18, 61. Roger Maris and Mickey Mantle race to break Babe Ruth's single-season home run record. Starring Barry Pepper, Thomas Jane, and Anthony Michael Hall. Directed by Billy Crystal. Most of the details of the games recreated for the film were based on Billy Crystal's first-hand memories of having seen or watched actual games. This was the highest rated movie by Rotten Tomato audiences, coming in at 90%. Number 17, Million Dollar Arm. A sports agent stages an unconventional recruitment strategy to find talented Indian cricket players to play American baseball. Starring John Hamm, Alan Arkin, Bill Paxton, Lake Bell, and Asif Mandvi. Based on a true story of baseball pitchers Rinku Singh and Dinesh Patel, who were discovered after winning a reality show competition. Number 16. Trouble with the Curve. A daughter tries to reconcile her dysfunctional relationship with her ailing father by helping him on his last baseball scouting trip. Starring Clint Eastwood, Amy Adams, John Goodman, and Justin Timberlake. This was Clint Eastwood's first major acting role in a movie that he did not direct in over 19 years since In the Line of Fire. Number 15. Fever Pitch. Lindsay is stuck in the middle of her relationship with Ben and his fanatical obsession with the Boston Red Sox, starring Drew Barrymore and Jimmy Fallon. This movie is based on Nick Hornby's autobiographical account of his own fanatical obsession with soccer that was originally made into a movie in 1997. Famously, this film had to be rewritten since the Red Sox won their first World Series in 86 years during the very season while this was being made. Number 14, Sugar. Dominican baseball player Miguel Sugar Santos is recruited to play in the U.S. minor leagues. Directed by Anna Bowden and Ryan Fleck, known for their collaborations Half Nelson, Sugar, It's Kind of a Funny Story, Mississippi Grind, and Captain Marvel. Sugar received many positive critic reviews, including a Rotten Tomatoes score of 92%, Metacritic of 82, and the American Film Institute's Top 10 Movies of 2009. Number 13, Eight Men Out. The dramatization of the Black Sox scandal, when the underpaid Chicago White Sox accepted bribes to deliberately lose the 1919 World Series. Starring John Cusack, D.B. Sweeney, Charlie Sheen, and Christopher Lloyd. Both Eight Men Out and Field of Dreams came out within six months of each other and helped increase public sympathy for overturning Shoeless Joe Jackson's lifetime ban from baseball. Number 12, The Pride of the Yankees. The story of the life and career of Hall of Fame baseball player Lou Gehrig, who played more than 2,000 consecutive games before falling to a deadly nerve disease. Starring Gary Cooper, Teresa Wright, and Babe Ruth. The American Film Institute ranked this as third on the greatest sports films of all time, and it has the number 38 movie quote of all time, Lou Gehrig's famous retirement speech. Number 11, Everybody Wants Some. A group of college baseball players navigate their way through the freedoms and responsibilities of unsupervised adulthood. Written and directed by Richard Linklater. This film is said to be a follow-up to two movies, Days and Confused, and Boyhood, centering around the life of a college student. Number 10, The Rookie. A high school chemistry teacher and baseball coach agrees to try out as a major league pitcher when his team wins the district championship. Starring Dennis Quaid, 
Rachel Griffiths, and Brian Cox. This movie is directed by John Lee Hancock, the son of John D. Hancock, the director of Bang the Drum Slowly. Number 9. The Bad News Bears A down-on-his-luck, aging ex-minor leaguer coaches a team of no-talent misfits in an ultra-competitive California Little League. Starring Walter Matthau, Tatum O'Neill, and an early appearance by Jackie Earl Haley. The Bad News Bears was followed by two sequels, a remake, and a 26-episode TV sitcom. This is also the highest-rated movie on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 8. Major League. The new owner assembles a purposely horrible team, so they'll lose and she can move the franchise to a warmer climate. When the plot is uncovered, the team starts winning despite her. Starring Tom Berenger, Charlie Sheen, and Corbin Burnson. In real life, Charlie Sheen was a high school pitcher and was even offered a scholarship to the University of Kansas. Number 7. The Natural. An unknown middle-aged batter seemingly comes out of nowhere to become a legendary baseball player with almost supernatural talent. Starring Robert Redford, Robert Duvall, and Glenn Close. Robert Redford was 47 at the time of filming this movie. This film takes place in 1939, which was the 100th anniversary of baseball and the year that the Baseball Hall of Fame opened. Number 6. 42. The story of Jackie Robinson the legendary baseball player who broke Major League Baseball's color barrier and endured unrelenting racist hostility on and off the field, starring Chadwick Boseman and Harrison Ford. In 1997, baseball commissioner Bud Selig universally retired Jackie Robinson's number 42. No Major League player will ever wear 42 again. Number 5. The Sandlot. In the summer of 1962, a new kid in town is taken under the wing of a young baseball prodigy and his rowdy team, resulting in many adventures. Starring Tom Guiri and Mike Vitar. Set in California, but filmed in Utah. The Sandlot has two direct-to-video sequels. This is one of the most popular baseball movies on the list, with the highest average rating on IMDb, TMDb, and Just Watch, and coming in second for the total number of ratings. Number 4. Bull Durham. A baseball groupie who has an affair with one minor league baseball player each season meets up with an up-and-coming pitcher and the veteran catcher assigned to him. Starring Kevin Costner, Susan Sarandon, and Tim Robbins. This was the highest ranked movie on Rotten Tomatoes at 97% tied with the Bad News Bears. Kevin Costner played the older, more experienced player at age 33. He's only three years older than Tim Robbins and nine years younger than Susan Sarandon who was 42 when this movie came out. Number 3. A League of Their Own When America's young men were fighting in World War II, two sisters joined the first female professional baseball league and struggled to help it succeed amid their own growing rivalry. Starring Tom Hanks, Gina Davis, and Lori Petty. Also with Madonna and Rosie O'Donnell. There's No Crying in Baseball came in at number 54, the all-time movie quotes list by the American Film Institute. This is also the highest rated movie on Letterboxd with 3.8 out of 5. Number 2. Field of Dreams. A farmer is inspired by a voice he can't ignore to pursue a dream he can hardly believe. A quest of turning his ordinary cornfield into a place where dreams come true. Starring Kevin Costner, James Earl Jones, and Ray Liotta. The studio built a baseball diamond on an actual farm in Dyersville, Iowa. In 2021, Major League Baseball started a recurring regular season game played in a ballpark adjacent to the site. Number 1. Moneyball Oakland A's general manager Billy Bean's successful attempt to assemble a baseball team on a lean budget by employing computer-generated analysis to acquire new players. Starring Brad Pitt, Robin Wright, Jonah Hill, Philip Seymour Hoffman, and Chris Pratt. This was the first baseball movie to be nominated for the Best Picture Academy Award since Field of Dreams. This was the most popular movie on the list, with the highest number of total votes, and is also the highest rated movie on Metascore and Letterboxd. Thanks for watching. You can check out the complete list on Letterboxd or IMDb. Links are in the description.